Tammy C. Walker here, owner of Dreams Are a Reality. S U C C E S S is on its way, but will you be ready? Find something you cannot afford to pay for. Tap into it. So, Tammy C. Walker here. Hit the like button for me. People are not hitting my like button. Please hit it. It does help me to get my videos generated and rotating around the universe. Hit subscribe if you're new and if you're returning. Hello. So today I want to talk about something that many people say they want. S-U-C-C-E-S-S. -S, success. Of course we all want that. But will you be truly ready? Let's just say, for an example, I always use the bakery or the catering business because that is one that seems like that would overwhelm me. I just can't lie. If I had a catering business and, you know, it's been open three months and things are sort of slow. And all of a sudden with Thanksgiving coming, with Christmas coming, and I received like a bunch of catering orders, would I be ready? Let's say you have your own hair salon. It's just your salon. You're in there by yourself and you may have a shampoo assistant a couple of days. You get two, three, four clients per day, like Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, but Friday and Saturday are your busier days. All of a sudden, with Thanksgiving coming, with Christmas coming, you just become overbooked. Would you be ready? We always say we want success, but with success, it comes a high price tag of quality, of good customer service. Are you going to be ready? You see so many small businesses and large businesses fail because they do grow. And the quality of the food, of the clothing, of the hairstyles begin to deteriorate because they cannot keep up with the pace of the business. So as they always say, be careful what you wish for, you just might get it. Even in relationships, you hear people saying, I'm waiting on my husband, I'm looking for my husband, I wanna get married. Do you really? Are you ready to be that supportive wife or that doting husband? It's a big deal to get married. It's more than that wedding, walking down the aisle. You have to show up day in and day out. And some days you do not want to be bothered. But when you say I do, it means you must do. And it means you must show love and respect and be there for your husband or your wife. It's a big deal. I've been married. And I think marriage is not taught in school or our parents. Sometimes they don't do a good job telling us the severity and the importance of the foundation of marriage, the union, you are one. So it's good to want success. I always tell people to go for the best, you know, but when it comes, you must be ready. You must deliver quality products, quality life coaching services, quality therapy services, quality hairstyles, quality clothes, quality food in relationships show up every day. No, every day is not going to be Christmas. Every day you're not going to be in a good spirit or good mood. But show up. Spend time with your partner. Spend time with your husband, your wife. No more of that I'm hanging out with the girls over and over or all these girls trips over and over. I think everybody should have, you know, their hobbies. Or I'm not against people going on trips with their friends. But if that's what you always do and you never do it with your spouse then why did you get married? That's just my little take. I'm more or less, if I'm married or if I'm in a committed relationship, I enjoy being with my partner more so than with a bunch of ladies. That's just me. And I'm no digs to my friends. My friends feel the same way. <laughs> but um, I wouldn't mind a girl's trip here and there, but that's not why I'm getting married, to hang out with a bunch of ladies. Where were these ladies? I've been divorced now 20 years. I don't see nobody banging down my door to go on a girl's trip with me. So I'm just saying, I'm just saying, S-U-C-C-E-S-S, -S, success in all things. If you want it, if you're praying for it, if you're striving for it, 
when it comes to your door and it's coming if you're good at what you do deliver deliver the top-notch products so for now if you don't quite have it enjoy the ride prepare yourself for the day when you will have a lot of customers you will have a lot of business and I would rather have a slow business and work my way up than a boom and I screw up <laughs> Tammy C Walker hit that like hit subscribe Drop me some comments about success, how it came to you, how maybe it didn't, and where you are in your YouTube channel, in your business, in your career. I always love my comments. I appreciate every viewer. You all mean so much to me. I hope you're having a great day. It's Monday. I have to be honest, I'm having a great day. Very productive at work. Had a super productive weekend, and I'm looking forward to helping a lot of clients this week. I have a busy week. A lot of people have been reaching out and calling uh, me to set up appointments. Not really calling. It's mostly via email or text. But anyway, I feel grateful and gracious um, that somebody thinks enough of this little girl. No longer a little girl. But originally, I was a little girl from the west side of Chicago. And if someone thinks enough of me to come and sit in the office with me and tell me they're confidential information i consider it a blessing and an honor they could go to anybody else but they pick me so i just want to stay humble over being a therapist bye